Verse of the Day October 27, 2022 Pride, what do we seek when we pray? Luke chapter 18 verses 9 to 10 Devotion Pride Which are you? Which am I? The Pharisee or the tax collector, whose prayer is pleasing to God? Pride versus humility is probably the message of this parable. We know that pride is one of the seven deadlies, but this Pharisee didn't seem to get that. He stood there telling God how wonderful he was, how many good deeds he had done, and best of all, how much better he was than everyone else. Somehow, I don't think that God was impressed. The tax collector knew that he was considered a sinner, especially in the eyes of other Jews, because he was working for the Romans. He probably had no idea how much God loved him. Jesus turns the world of the Pharisees upside down by telling them that the prayer of the tax collector was more pleasing to God than that of the self-righteous Pharisee. I bet you know people I know I do who put others down in order to feel better about themselves, who judge others by the way they dress, where they live, how much money they have, if they have an accent, or a different color skin. God is the only one who has the right to judge, for he alone knows what is in people's hearts. This Pharisee only sees the externals, and also judges himself by his show of goodness rather than goodness of spirit. The tax collector only wants God's mercy, not approval. He recognizes his failings and doesn't even dare to ask for forgiveness, only mercy. What do we seek when we pray? Do we compare ourselves to others in our minds and find ourselves better than them? Or, do we recognize our faults and failings and beg God to make us better people? So, I'm back to the first question. Am I a Pharisee or a tax collector? Let us pray. Lord, as often as I try not to do it, I sometimes find myself judging others. Please help me to love others as you love them, and see all people as your beloved sons and daughters. Amen.